بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ایوری ون ویلکم بیک ٹو پروگریسو ویب اپلیکیشن ٹوٹوریلس دس از علی رضا اینڈ ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو ٹیل یو اباؤٹ ہاؤ کین وی ناؤ ایکسیس آر کیش آبجیکٹس اور دا ریسورسز وین وی آر آف لائن سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ اینڈ ہیو اے لک واٹ وی ہیو ٹوڈے رائٹ گائز سو ان دا پریویس لیکچر وی ہیو کریٹیڈ آر کیش اے اینڈ وی ہیو اسٹورڈ آر ریکویسٹیڈ ریسورسز ان سائڈ آر کیش اے اینڈ دیز آر دا ریسورس دیز آر دا ریسورسز اوکے سو لیٹس گو اینڈ ٹرائی ٹو ڈو دا نیکسٹ اسٹیپ Now when we have stored all the files inside the cache that we have requested, now it's time when we are going to fetch. So this is the fetch event uh, when we are getting the uh, resources coming back from the server, this event is uh, uh, occurred, okay. So we know that uh, service worker is intercepting the request and the response. So what, it will, what we will do, we will check here inside our cache when the fetch event is uh, ha occurred, will occur. So we will check here that uh, whether the resource is available in the cache or it is not available in the cache. Okay. So let's check how can we do this. Let's remove this line because we don't need it further. The first thing that I have to write here is EVT. That's our event. Okay. What is whatever we are receiving. Okay. If you do not understand this EVT, let me show you that again. Uh, let's come here and you see here the event in the console. when we refresh our application uh, okay so what will happen the the uh, wait a minute let me uh, just remove this line and show you this save it and come here so you see these are the events that uh, that are dis that were displayed on the browser so evt is giving me all these things so let me open this and let us uh, open the request and you see here every request has this particular url and the things related to this so uh, the fetch event is basically displaying me all the related things with the help of this evt um, parameter returning okay now so what i am doing just provide evt and then you will pass here respond with that's a function okay so what will happen this respond with function will pause the fetch event from execution and instead of the original fetch event my own custom defined fetch event now will execute i hope it is clear to everyone the next step is when we have specified the respond with a uh, function then what i have to do i have to check here that whether the cache is that is this one dot match whatever caches i have 1 2 3 4 any number of caches that i have created if caches dot match what we have, what we have to match evt dot request why i have written this let me go back to the browser and the thing that i have shown you you can see this that's my event and inside this event this is my request and this is the thing that we have requested okay so if the event dot request is matched okay or it is available inside the cache that we have requested then what we have to do this is a callback function then we apply the promise promise is a chain series so if the cache is the is the requested event is there or the resource is there then what we have to do we have to put inside something let's say uh, obj okay so I have put the, that thing inside obj and then let's go and write a callback function put that thing inside obj and now we have to use this obj we have to return this simple so return and then specify here obj this means that if the event that we have if the request that we if or if the resource that we have requested is matched or it is available inside the cache then pick it up with the help of this promise function that is then and store inside the obj and then uh, and return it simple and but what if if the requested object or the resource is not available inside the cache then we have to specify an or condition and specify the fetch event again and how can we specify the fetch event simply by specifying the fetch function and just write here evt dot request okay so what will happen whatever the request we have you see here this is the request okay if the requested uh, 
object or the resource is not available inside the cache then it will simply f uh, run the fetch event again i hope it is clear to everyone guys so now it's time to check whether it is working or not so you see now uh, we have reloaded service worker registered and now application and let's go back to the uh, service workers and you see everything is uh, perfect up uh, perfectly updated because i have checked on the upload uh, updated on reload so things are fine cache is there all, all things are cached now let's refresh this so you see things are coming now again now this is the same behavior because we are still online how can we go now offline so let's click on the network and simply click here um, in the offline button so let's go sorry go to the application and close this all click on the service workers and simply check this offline now we are in offline mode okay but you see these are the things that are requested now from the service worker not from the server okay so that's the thing that is quite awesome for us to access our things with the help of the service worker not from the direct servers because we are now offline so let's try to refresh this and you see things are there but only one thing that is not uh, fetched that is the manifest file manifest.json because we haven't specified that in the uh, cached object so we have to do this let's try to add the manifest.json file as well so let's write here manifest forward slash and you see the manifest file is also in the root directory so manifest.json and save that's it and here we have to specify comma and come here and just reload this but first of all you see when I reload this the manifest file is uh, coming now from the service worker I hope it is clear to everyone so we are in the offline mode right now you see here okay so our page is now accessing perfectly I hope it is clear to everyone so this is our guys this is the charm or the beauty of the PWA app that we can access it offline just like other apps so I hope you have understood this if you do not understand anything please do write me till then see you take care Allah Hafiz